Hi, I'm Stuart Benjamin. I am the William Van Alstyne Professor of Law at Duke Law School, and I'm here to talk about the FCC and the spectrum. The spectrum is the range of wireless frequencies over which radio waves can travel. And radio waves doesn't mean your radio, it means any form of communication. By statute, the government controls the spectrum, that is to say, the wireless frequencies, and it gives out licenses uh, to private entities that use the spectrum. Those licenses are very valuable. Those licenses are now distributed via auction. Those auctions have raised more than $200 billion for the U.S. Treasury. The licenses are for a limited duration, so a common term would be eight years. Licensees generally want to keep those licenses. They're very valuable. So it's very important to licensees that they can renew their licenses. The FCC has to approve renewal of licenses. It has to approve transfers of licenses. And it does so under an unusually broad standard. The standard is whether the public interest, convenience, or necessity would be served by the renewal or by the transfer. This is an unusual kind of power and it's a very great kind of power that the FCC has and it's specific to spectrum licenses. Denials of licenses by the FCC are very rare. There have been only a handful in the last 25 years and only for egregious violations of the statutes governing licensees. 